What's going on traders? Welcome back to another video. AMC is on fire today. I'm going to explain why I think we have a shot of testing $50 this week and possibly even breaking past 50 and triggering a gamma squeeze once again like we did back in the mid-30 range before we hit $48. Also, we're going to bring up one stock in which I think falls into the basket of the short squeeze category in which can possibly squeeze in the coming days to possibly the coming weeks. Let's get right into it. AMC, we have to talk about the pattern guys which is so beautiful. If you haven't noticed, AMC has the same pattern it did back in April and May when it was stuck at $10, $15, trading sideways and forming higher lows. However, this time around, it's much slower of a staircase up and not, not necessarily so parabolic in which we did here in the case of 77, which of course can be caused um, can cause a massive pullback with profit takers and whatnot. However, this time around, we're kind of stair-stepping up. We're finding higher support levels, which wasn't the case when we we're back in um, uh, early June when we hit 77. There really wasn't any tested support levels. It just went parabolic. This time around, we're actually holding 40, which was something I, me I mentioned last week. Keep perspective. This stock, yes, indeed pulled back, but we struggled so long to break 40 again. And now this stock is actually holding 40, and the options chain is looking mean. It's looking aggressive. It's looking stacked at 50. That whole number, a psychological wall there. I don't know if it's going to be such a wall if we start to hedge or if these market makers start to hedge as the calls start uh, being placed into the money. And it could trigger a gamma squeeze. You know, there's a bunch of retail investors on the sidelines waiting. And you know how they pile, they pile in and cause this massive gamma squeeze. Somewhat of a short squeeze as well. You guys know I'm a fanatic of saying, uh, or I'm an advocate of saying there is some short squeeze um, covering, which adds to the buying pressure and leads the stock up higher to, who knows, we might be even hit 100. We don't know. But the SI is currently sitting at 17% right now. Big five is the other stock that I have on watch, which is matching the, um, the SI that support has, which is 71%. Um, SPRT, by the way, is actually pulling back right now into close. SPRT is another one that has um, above 50 short, S, uh, short interest. S3 Partners actually reported 60%. This is T plus 2, keep in mind. So I don't know if there's a discrepancy around 11% on the short interest. But Big 5 is sitting at 66%. S3 uh, Partners reported short interest for Big 5 at 48 which is still pretty uh, high up there. And if you take a look at the stock, um, you can see that some people are starting to pick up on this and this stock is actually moving up headed into the dividend they're paying we're at 28 can we retest the highs of 37 on the four hour possibly this is another one that you uh, want to have and watch and i'm not a show for saying watch other stocks trust me there's people out there that are going to take advantage of this and profit but be careful be safe support is another one that i actually said in my pullback don't fall for these stocks. They're just going to be like um, the a couple months ago when we had Clover, Wendy's, uh, Blackberry. These stocks didn't really necessarily sustain themselves. Yes, they popped up. People made some money. But there's people also who got left holding the bag. There's no such thing like a stock like GameStop or AMC that actually has the attention. And it retains the volume as well, too. It's not. I don't think support's gonna be. I don't think Big Five is gonna be. I don't think. I don't think support as PRT is gonna be one of those other stocks as well. I think there's only gonna be two for now. We'll know. Maybe, who knows? Maybe that changes throughout the rest of the year. But be careful. If you have the appetite for risk, be my guest. Take a, take advantage of this opportunity. Be safe. Be well. And I will see you guys tomorrow for uh, Wednesday for another update and tomorrow for a new live stream. Peace out.